let's have a look at the best menswear from Wes Anderson's recent premiere of Asteroid City. So first up we've got Wes himself in a black tie. Quite a big departure from his usual various colours of corduroy. Now I really like his signature look, I also like this. Very simple and some beautiful horse bit loafers to match. Next up Tom Hanks in an all black fit. The suit's very nicely cut but it is a bit on the boring side. One person who's never on the boring side is Jeff Goldblum. I don't really know what to say here but I really like it. It's eccentric, it's interesting and it suits him. It's mostly down to the colour palette as well, it's very Wes Anderson. Much more toned down is Adrian Brody's fit. But it's a beautiful suit, lovely peak lapels, really nice cut and some good footwear too. Another person who did get the colour palette memo was Tony Revolori. I'm a fan. Darren Chris showed everyone how to do a high rise trouser. I've seen a lot of these sort of crochet shirts and I actually really like it. Next we have the Rupert Friend in this kind of tobacco suit with some really wide trousers. Again, I really like this. Love the colour. I really like that the jacket is a usual kind of standard fitted jacket, but the trousers are super wide. It's a really nice silhouette. And lastly, probably my favourite look of the night is Brian Cranston. He's used tonal dressing with that undershirt that's just slightly lighter. Now, normally I prefer a bigger lapel, but I think as this suit is, and with the untucked t-shirt, I think it really works. 